Though it might not look the part now, this former Fuddruckers is the new home of Mike Lentz's Scratch Barbecue. You know, when we work weddings, the number one question is, where's your restaurant? And then for years, I've been able to say, we don't have one. And, you know, now we can say, hey, we've got one. You know, come spend some time with us and, and enjoy yourself. After 21 years at Flushing High School, this teacher is trading his markers and whiteboards for smokers and knives. Teaching it to me is a great way to serve the community, and we're hoping here to serve the community. We, we've got a plan for every pound of meat that we sell. We want to donate a dollar to a, a local nonprofit, and so I'll be reaching out to some nonprofits to, to see if we can help sponsor them. Demolition on the building began the day Linz bought it, December 30th. He's ripped up flooring, ceiling, and still has plenty to go. The plan is to be open sometime this summer. Lintz and his wife Amy used the Flint Farmers Market's business incubator, Flint Food Works, to test out their catering business seven years ago after a particularly successful church fundraiser. Texas is a real simple, um, you know, kosher salt and, and uh, black peppers, like their, their base for their brisket, and that's what we use. And it's always fun to hear people want to know what our secret rub is for our brisket. I'm like, it's just salt and pepper and smoking it the right way. Linz had been looking around for a brick and mortar place for a while. And when the classroom door closes, the restaurant door opens. The first four nights I was uh, joking with some friends. I said I felt like pregame before a varsity football game. I wanted to throw up. Um, very nervous. Uh, but subsequently, it's, it's gone well. I, I, I feel better being in here on a daily basis and seeing the progress. The fast casual Texas barbecue joint will have a full service bar, bakery, and ice cream stand. In Flint, Trevor Sahaki, WNEM TV5. Definitely an exciting addition to Miller Road. Well, Scratch Barbecue hopes to get their kitchen certified by the health department soon so they can start catering events before opening the restaurant.